The body of Agent Ivy transported from Tucson to Sierra Vista today in a somber procession. The procession stopped traffic along the way as drivers got out of their cars to pay their respects as the hearse drove by. Not in your sides, Corey Marshall continues team coverage live in Sierra Vista. Guy, it's, it's really moving. A couple of hours ago, a procession of Border Patrol vehicles came through this area just behind me, ushering in the hearse that carried the body of Agent Ivy. Now, even more mo moving, complete strangers. People stopped here just to watch and pay their respects for the fallen agent. Miles and miles of Border Patrol cars lining Highway 92. People stopping their cars in center turn lanes, paying respect to Agent Nicholas Ivy as the body of the 30 year old Border Patrol agent is brought to Hatfield Funeral Home in Sierra Vista. I think it's great to see all these people that came out. I mean, as I was coming down from the college, I saw that the, the church down there had all their little preschoolers out there and their kindergartners out there to show respect for our fallen Border Patrol agent. Patricia Rosales says the Ivy family is a member of her church. He just was a wonderful man and my heart hurts for his family and his wife and his two children. Ivy's family shielded in support by fellow Border Patrol agents gathered outside the funeral home as dozens of patrol cars pour in and a community watches. It's very heartbreaking and it's extremely nerve wracking when people are putting their lives on the line to protect us and we can't really do anything to pay them back. I am very touched and I'm really very angry. Longtime Sierra Vista resident Carletta Skaggs didn't know Agent Ivy. Why are you out here today? Um, to honor the man who served our country and every bit as much as the men that go to Afghanistan. And it's getting to be where it's almost more dangerous for them than it is our soldiers. Rosales says she wants the Ivy family to know they have the backing of an entire community. I'm still just shaking. I mean, it, it's just. Open fire on Amazing the, the love and support that Border Patrol has for their families. Now, we spoke with several people who went to church with Agent Ivy, and one woman we spoke with says she wants people to know just what a good family man he was, just a true, a true family man and a good father. It's a sentiment that we're hearing over and over again. Reporting live in Sierra Vista, Corey Marshall, KIGA 9 on your side. Corey, we understand that this is a tough time for the family. Have they at any point issued a statement or anything like that? Not yet, but they were out here today for the arrival of Agent Ivy's body. Corey Marshall, thanks so much.